Hello. We're going to set up the footer section of the Metro Pro theme by Studio Press. If you scroll down to the bottom of the page, there's another box that can appear here and you can put three different things in. You've got three boxes. You've got footer area one, footer two and footer three. Now, the important thing to remember is you can't put things into footer two until you put things into footer one. You've got to start off with footer one, then do footer two, then do footer three. You can't just have one, uh, th one thing in the middle footer section. And if you go to the customizer, you'll actually see there, it only shows you footer one. Now there are actually two more options, footer two and footer three, but it won't make those options available until you've used footer one. Anyway, we're going to do this using the, um, the widgets. So if you go to dashboard appearance widgets, this is the old fashioned way of doing it. <laughs> so we're going to set up footer one, footer two, footer three. It gives us a bit more space when we're working on such a small screen. All we need to do, open footer, so we're in dashboard appearance widgets, open footer one, and we're going to drag the recent posts widget into that widget area. So let's find recent posts and we just drag it into the widget area. Put in a title, type whatever you like in there. Choose how many recent posts, it will show links to recent posts. Type a number in there, whatever you want. Click save and we'll see what's happened. Scroll down to the bottom of our page. Refresh the page. And now we've got the first footer section set up. And that's how, how widgets work. You just drag a widget into a widget area and it appears on the page. So footer two, we'll add a calendar just so you can see how different things go in there. Just put a title for your calendar. And I'm going to add a recent comments widget in the third box. There's loads of widgets to choose from. And sometimes when you install plugins, the plugin might have a widget with it. A widget might come with certain plugins. And that's where your widgets come from. Some are, some are standard in WordPress and some come along with uh, plugins when you install plugins. We're going to add a recent comments widget. So if we look for that one, recent comments widget there. Drag that in there. Now we'll put recent comments. You can title it whatever you want. We're going to show the five most recent comments. Could change that if we wanted to. Click save. And we'll now go back to our front page. We had just one there before. And now we've got the others. We could have picked any of the widgets. Um, whatever it suits us, we could put in there. And that's how it's done. Well, that's it for the footer. Let's move on.